Welcome to Sonic World Video Solutions. My name is Kritika Nakshatri. Today, we will see how to block a website using Content Filter. To block a website using Content Filter, you need to first ensure that Content Filter service is licensed on your Sonic World. Content Filter service is commonly known as CFS. Configure the site that you need to block as a forbidden domain and then enable CFS on the appropriate zone. Today for demonstration, we are using a SonicWorld NSA220 with the firmware version 5.9.0.3. We have the content filtering service licensed on this unit. Moving to the configuration, go to the Security Services tab, Content Filter, Click on Configure option next to the Content Filter service. Go to the Custom list. Using the Sonic World Content Filter service, you can add domains that are considered as allowed domains or forbidden domains and there is also an option for keyword blocking. In this case, let us consider a site games.com. Considering that you want to block this particular site, we click on Add Give the domain name as games.com. Click on OK to save the settings. Click on OK once again. Next, we need to make sure that content filter is applied on the zone on which it is required. Go to the Network Zones page. On the zone on which content filter is required to be applied, click on the Configure button. Make sure Enforce Content Filtering Service is enabled. By design, the CFS policy is set to default. If required, you can change it to a custom policy. Click on OK to save the settings. The configuration is now complete. You can test it from any of the devices on the network. To test from the system that we are currently on, we need to first go back to the Security Services tab content filter. Under CFS exclusion for the administrator, you will see an option that says do not bypass CFS blocking for the administrator. Enable this checkbox. Click on accept. This option will ensure that you are not bypassed from the content filter blocking even though you are logged into the Sonic wall on this particular computer. Now we can open another tab and go to games.com. You can now see that the content filter has successfully blocked games.com and also displays the content filter block page. This brings us to the end of this video on how to block websites using content filter.